Hey guys, what's up? It's Amber and welcome back to my channel or welcome if you're new here And if you are new here, you should definitely subscribe So for today's video, I am so excited to be bringing you guys yet another unboxing video I love doing unboxing videos on my channel. I think that they're so fun today I'm gonna be testing out a new hair styling product, but before we jump into that I'm gonna be doing shout out of the week real quick this week's shout out of the week goes to Emily She is at needy underscore 93 X on Twitter. She really wanted to be shout out of the week So here you go shout Shout out to you, boo. If you guys want to find out what is in here, then just keep watching. We are diving right into this package with my Eiffel Tower scissors. I see a box in a box. Okay, you guys. So this is what we are going to be playing with today. This is the Duval Impulse Flat Iron. This is supposed to be really good. We are going to be trying it today. The packaging already right off the bat is blowing me away. Like, look at how beautiful this is. Wow. I feel like I'm buying something really nice. First impression, the packaging is beautiful. And inside it's velvet and the straightener is tucked in here in some plastic. First, before we jump in, I'm just gonna read you the product description, the price, all of that stuff online just before we get started. As I said, this is by the company Duval. They make all kinds of other stuff. I actually own the Duval spin brush for your face and I got that as a gift from Gabby. A lot of you guys know Gabby DiMartino. I went to her fancy sleepover and she gave those away to everyone and I've literally Literally been using it every day since it's amazing and it's so funny how Duval reached out to me and in fact when I looked at the email it was from before the fancy sleepover so it's not even like that's why they reached out to me so I don't know I feel super happy that they wanted to work with me on this disclaimer I'm not being paid to say anything at all they just sent me this for free to try for a video for you guys this is called the impulse hair straightener and it retails for $195 but don't even freak out I have a coupon for 70% off it's gonna be on the screen it is amber sun so definitely make sure that at the end of this video you decide you want to get anything from Duval you can use that promo code and this is described as this professional grade straightening iron is one of a kind featuring our FAR infrared generation technology termaline coated plates for superior straightening and hold hmm. as well as extra negative ion generation technology to lock in moisture and rubberized exterior coating for comfortable grip and ease of control while styling this is the the last straightening iron you will ever buy. First of all, can we just say, I have a straightener that is literally falling apart. The on and off button does not work. I have to like jam a freaking bobby pin in there to turn it on and off. So when Duval reached out to me asking for me to choose a product from their site to review, I picked the straightener because I was like, I need a new straightener so badly. So we are gonna see, hopefully this is the last one I buy. And also I have super thick curly hair, if you could not tell. This is my hair situation. I'm not gonna lie, my hair has gotten much thinner over the years, but ever since I was a kid, my hair has been so thick that I don't even know how to maintain it. Literally ask my mom. She would have to help me brush it. My cousin Haley has helped me brush it before. When it gets knotted, it is no joke. And also the curls have kind of gotten less intense as I've gotten older. They used to be so intense and now they're kind of just like waves, but my hair is very voluminous and thick. And this is completely natural. I took a shower this morning and I let it air dry all day long. Here we are to put this straightener to work. And then it got a ton of good reviews, of course. I guess let's just dive right into this. So when you open her up, we already saw that the straightener is just kind of chilling in here in this velvet lining. I'm gonna take it out right now. And it looks like it has a really long cord, which is awesome because my other one did not have a long cord. Once you take it out of the plastic, this is what it looks like. It looks so sleek and beautiful. And I like that it's very simple and does not have many buttons. It has an on and off button right here and then it has 270 degrees Fahrenheit all the way up to 450 degrees Fahrenheit. I'm assuming you can adjust the temperature. Let me look in the instructions real quick. I love right here it has a little chart on what temperature the straightener should be on depending on your type of hair. So it says for fragile, fine, or chemically processed hair use 270 degrees. Normal easy to straighten hair 320 degrees to 360 degrees. Resistant thick wavy hair 410 to 450. So I'm gonna follow the directions and we are gonna use 410 degrees to start for my hair. I'm so freaking excited right now. I have been wanting a new straightener for so long. I almost asked for one for Christmas, but then shout out to Michael at Duval. Thanks for hitting me up and asking for me to pick a product because this is so needed. <laughs> Moment of truth. Okay, it is on. I'm gonna turn it up all the way to 410 degrees, which is the second highest that you can have it at. One more and it'll be at 450. I'm gonna read how long it says it takes to heat up. The red power light will also turn on 
Oh my god, whoa! Can you see that? Holy crap! That is so cool! The red power light will also turn on and begin to blink once the selected temperature is reached. So it says that once this power light is blinking that it's reached the correct temperature. If so, that's really fast. It doesn't feel super hot to touch on the outside so it won't burn your little kids if they come over and touch just the back part. There is definitely a lot of heat coming off the middle panels. My hair is getting thicker and thicker by the moment. It's like growing. So a lot of you guys have asked me to do a hair care routine in the past and I just don't do enough with my hair where I would have a whole video on it, you know? Literally, when I'm about to take a shower, I brush my hair out with a comb. I used to use a brush, but I mostly use combs. I don't know. Like I said, my hair's thinned out a lot over the years. It's still super thick, but it's not so much knotted and tangled so I can use a comb very easily on it. This is a purple wide tooth comb that I got years ago. Like it's missing a little spike. I got this so many years ago. Then also I have this Conair comb. This morning before I got in the shower, I combed out my hair with this comb and my hair was just nice and smooth. Combed it after I got out of the shower as well. And then I left my hair up in a towel all day to air dry. And then after I get out of the shower, also while my hair is still wet and after I've combed it out, I put in these two products. First, I spray this all over the ends of my hair. And this is called the Blow Dry It Quick Dry Primer Spray. And I don't blow dry my hair, but it's a nice heat protectant for your hair. I love the way that this stuff makes my hair feel. I don't know, I've used this for so many years. You can go back in my videos and you will see me mentioning this. So this is called the Blow Dry It Thermal Smoother Cream, and this makes my frizz so much better. I definitely love these two products. They're both by L'Oreal. I love them, I use them hand in hand. Like I said, I spray this one in first. Then I go in and put a little dollop of this in between my fingers, and I start off in my ends, and then I like to put some around my face here. So that's that on that. Now the straightener is pretty much heated up, so I think I'm gonna go to town. I don't usually section off my hair. I think just for this video I will, just to make it easier for myself. So I'm gonna be putting my hair up in a bun on top of my head while we do the bottom half. Don't mind how freaking crazy I look. Moment of truth, I'm gonna grab this first section. Ooh, okay, so that is one go about on this piece of hair. It's pretty straight. I'm gonna go down just a couple more times. Wow. I mean, it's straight. It's doing the job. I definitely think I'm gonna turn it up to 450 though. I think I need it really hot. I'm honestly just gonna like kind of go to town. And I'm not gonna lie to you guys, I don't ever straighten my hair. I mean, when do you guys ever see me with straight hair? I just don't do it because normally it's such a pain in the ass for me to straighten my hair. Hair straighteners typically just don't work for me because I have such thick hair. But honestly, this is working pretty good. It usually takes me so long to straighten my hair, which is another reason why I don't do it often. Whenever I do my hair, usually the most I'll do is go in and straighten the roots of my hair, like around the face and up until like here. I never really straighten the bottom just because I typically curl my hair anyway. I like when my hair is curly. I just, I embrace it. You know, I embrace the curly headedness. Where are my curly haired girls at? Comment down below. And I'm very messy about how I straighten my hair. I don't like to section it off all neat because like I said, it's taken way too long in the past that I just am not about that life. Right off the bat though, if you have easy to straighten hair, oh my God, like look at how easy this is straightening my hair. So if you have thinner hair, obviously this is a major yes for you. I still can't get over how cool it looks in there. Okay, so that is one section all done for the most part. I think I got all the pieces. Also, it is New Year's Eve right now. I can't even believe it's New Year's Eve. Like, who the f let that happen? I would like to know. I think I'm gonna go ahead and do the rest of my hair. And once I get to the very top layer, I will be right back. All right, you guys, we have reached the top final layer of my hair. So I figured I would show you how I do this. It's very simple. I literally just grab a piece of hair, start at the root. I kind of go over it a few times just to really smooth it out. 
Very simple. I just like for the top of my head to obviously be extra smooth and sleek because it's the layer that everyone sees. Underneath the hair, it's a little easier to hide pieces that maybe didn't straighten as well. This is so cool. I love how fast it straightens my hair. I love when things actually work. Like I'm not gonna lie, I was going into this expecting it to not work just because whenever I try new straighteners, hoping that it's gonna work, it never does. You should see the amount of times I've had people be like, oh my God, the straightener works so good and they've let me use it and I'm like, it literally did not straighten my hair. <laughs> I've always used just like really cheap straighteners from Target or Walmart because I was like, there's no point in spending money on a straightener when I know it's not gonna work for my thick ass mane. Moving on to the other side. All right, we are shutting her off now. Goodbye. I am just quickly gonna go in and take a tiny little bit of my coconut oil and put this through the ends of my hair. That's something I like to do usually after I straighten it. So I just like to warm this up in my fingers, which my hands are so hot from holding that straightener. And then I'm just gonna put a little bit through my ends. I might have taken like a little bit too much by accident, but that's fine. I just like for my ends to be very smooth. Okay, you guys, so this is the final result for my hair using the Duval Impulse Hair Straightener. Let me know what you think. Do you guys think it's like a crazy dramatic difference between the curly and the straight? Do you feel like it's just meh? Let me know down below. I personally love how my hair feels right now. Usually after I straighten my hair, by the time I do one side of my hair and move on to the other side, the first side's usually already starting to frizz up. It has not started frizzing up. I am super happy with this straight honestly I was not expecting to be this floored by it but I'm actually like really happy with this holy crap I will have this hair straightener as well as Duval's website linked down below in the description bar I will also have the coupon code which is amber Sun for 70% off so make sure you use that if you buy anything from Duval's website if you are looking for a new straightener this is hundred percent amber approved I think that it worked wonderfully on my thick hair all right you guys so that is it for today's video I don't know if it'll go up before midnight, but this is the final video I am filming in 2019. This is crazy. I'm just so thankful for you guys. Thank you for such an amazing year. Leave a comment down below. Follow me on social media. Subscribe if you guys want to be shout out of the week. But yeah, that is it for this video. Thank you guys so, so much for watching and I will see you in the next one.